Aloha and Halo from Hawaii. Geraldine and I are on vacation. We got a Go professional camera. It's a little camera, very high quality, and it also comes in a case. It's waterproof. It's a waterproof Go professional camera. And we got one. Geraldine's just testing out a little bit. Geraldine, how's that working? I think it's good. I think it's waterproof. I think it's good. So usually when we go on vacation, we just kind of wake up in the morning ready for adventure. Usually the adventure finds us, but um, let's go. surfer knows that in order to really catch the waves, even when the waves are crunchy, when they're not peeling like you want them crunchy, to, no um, you need to practice your moves on the land so when you're out in the sea that you, you've got it. You can nail it. You can hang ten, hang loose. Righteous! Righteous! So Lorraine and I, we're going to go across the street to a little field I like to call the Field of Dreams. Field of Dreams. Where we are going to I knew you were trouble and you What's really important is the stretch. The stretch is really important. One of the most important things is your stroke. You're paddling out there. You got to paddle. You got to go on your board and you're going and you're looking and you're looking and you're seeing the waves and you're scoping everything out. You see one coming. You see one coming and you're and you're stroking and you're stroking. You want to catch that wave. Catch the wave. Catch the wave. You hop up and then you're hanging. You're hanging tail. You're hanging tail. You're carving the wave. You're shredding the wave. You're shredding it like some cheese that you're going to put in your case of day or later. Just shredding that wave. I'm sorry. Are you seeing this? Don't you see it? I see it, Lorraine. That's, a, that's the most majestic dancing I have seen on this island thus far. I need to learn. Don't do it. We need to learn how to do this. Excuse me, ma'am. I need to learn what you do, how you do it. Give me everything, the emotion. I love that. This is a pareo. A and a pareo is a symbol of freedom and love. So I dance for freedom. I dance for love. I just pick songs that speak to my heart. It doesn't even matter who sings them. That's a good point. All right, will you show me some of your stuff? Absolutely. Okay. Did somebody say 
learn how to be a mermaid. I'm a mermaid that you gotta channel your inner mermaid number one. Think, I'm Ariel, I'm Ariel, I'm Ariel. Ariel, imagine my father is King Trident, my father is the king of the ocean, my father is, has a crab. That's number one. Number two, you gotta be limber. There you go. Throw a couple lunges in there like that. Now I know there's a, uh, a tendency to want to drop it low and, and twerk. Now remember that's okay, but your legs gotta stay together because you're a merc person now. This is Snooky the dog. On a scale from one to Ariel, how much mermaid do you guys feel now? swimming in the uh, damn water. Let's go!